Hey guys, on the Bricks here, today we're reviewing the exclusive Christmas build up set. This set was free with purchase of $99 or more in October, contains 250 pieces, set number 40222. And yeah, let's get right into it. Please note that it says models cannot be built at the same time, so it's really like a 24 in 1, the same way that a uh, creator house is a 3 in 1. When you take a look at the back of the package, it shows some of these. So I guess like the the reddish brown cones in this castle are the same reddish brown cones in this bridge, just reused, I think. So pretty cool. Let's get into this nice exclusive packaging. Just flipping it over, there's a uh, two pieces of tape right here. Just uh, able to cut those open with, uh, pretty easily. This is kind of like an ideas style box. You know, we should be able to open it up and it's kind of resealable, I think. This box, um, first item we have is the second instruction manual. The uh, first instruction manual should be in here somewhere. And yep, there it is. Um, then we have some parts. We have this bag of parts and another bag of parts. None of them are labeled or anything. Another bag of parts. And the biggest bag of parts. And it's not like they're really sorted out or anything. Like that. So, let me just uh, go down so you guys can see that. Over right here it actually says Season's Greetings right there. Got a nice uh, bit of black inside the box. So it can just be a... Uh, Resealed just like that. Let's just take a quick look at what's inside the instruction manual. It shows that you will need the brick separator. So you'll build one and take it apart and build two. Alright, let's take a look at each model. And here is the sailboat build for day one. Built on some little blue plates to show water. It looks pretty nice. You can see all around. The uh, build of it. I kind of like it. So, yeah, on to day two. Here is day two, or build two. It's like a little reindeer built on a little green plate for grass, I guess. It could be removed from that, I guess, if you want to just uh, stand there, but it looks nice on the plate. The uh, fiscal antlers are nice, and the uh, tail is a nice little build as well. Overall, very cool. Let's keep going. Day number three brings us this nice little present in Christmas colors. Nice build for the bow and everything. And it's uh, very cool. It's definitely one of my favorite ones maybe. I just like how solid it looks. And I definitely think it's really cool. Day four brings us this little dog. Or is it a monkey? I really can't tell actually. Um, if you know what this is, I guess tell me in the comments. Whether this is a dog or a monkey. Um, you guess say in the poll right here, whether this is a dog or a monkey. It's sitting like a dog, but the color scheme and the... I don't know. It's looking more and more like a dog to me. Anyways. Pretty cool build. You can see four feet of those little tooth pieces. So tooth pieces for the ears, and then that little face. Very cool. And, yeah, very nice build for day four. Number five in the holiday spirit is this little uh, snow plow. It's got some little clear bricks on the bottom, but those just end up making it fall uh, forward, which is kind of weird. Almost seems like it'd be better without them, but I guess it's provide support. And then you could uh, grab some little uh, bricks to act as snow if you want and try to uh, plow them away, just like that. Overall, very cool build for day five. Here we are with build number six. It's a fireplace. One of the more detailed ones of this uh, set. You can see in there there's some little fire and a little uh, Christmas stocking up there on the fireplace. Turning it around, you can see more detail. Uh, this thing is a very cool, clever build. And in comes day seven. It is a uh, little plain build, as you can see. <coughs> Primary colors are white. Some blue accents and a little bit of gray on the bottom, which is doesn't totally work the best, but it's okay. 
for uh, this scale. There's not too much you can do, but that's kind of a big piece. Under there, nice red tail. Overall, just very cool build for this little tiny airplane. And for day eight, we have this winking koala bear. Pretty cool. The tail can move up and down, just like so. Oops. And the feet just fell off, but pretty cool. So you can see all the way around. Very nice build. And that's that. Day 9 brings us this little candy cane build. It's kind of nice. The little uh, thing for a bow or something right there. Like the striping in it. I definitely think it's really nice. And pretty cool. The 10th build of this set is this little bear. Or I think it's a bear. It's a little winking face as you can see. And a uh, nice little nose and stuff. Overall, pretty cool. Build for day 10. Over in the 11th build is this nice little Christmas tree. I think it's really cool. It's built on this nice little white plate. And I'm not just saying it's, oh, it looks really cool. Like, I think all the builds look cool to some degree. But no, this is one of my favorites, actually, of this set, I'd say. I think it's really neat. Definitely uh, one of my favorites so far. Probably my favorite out of the last 11. And for the 12th build, there's this nice little house. It's pretty cool. Built on these... Uh, 4x4 four four base, and you can see it's got a nice little door, and shrubs, and a garage. It's really detailed, actually, and pretty cool. Anyways, that's, and it looks, doesn't look too good from the back, but very cool detail to build. And because we are halfway done, of course, 24 builds, this was day 12, we now switch off to the second instruction manual. So let's do that. Now let's start building with this one. Alright, day 13 brings us this little miniature robot build. He is built on these little red feet. Got some nice blue eyes. As well as these cute little robot arms. And some nice little detailing for this little toy robot. Anyway, it's a pretty cool little build for day 13. Alright, the 14th build is this nice little bridge with a little duck going under it or something. The bridge build looks nice. It's like a mini scale. Maybe walking over there. I think it really looks cool. I like these mini architecture ones. Probably the best. Anyways, great little build for day 14. Let's move on. Right to the 15th build is this little cat build. Like the uh, build for the face. I think the whiskers are clever ideas using the toothpiece. Anyways, pretty cool build for day 15. And I definitely like it a little bit. These animal ones are always a little iffy. But here's one that's definitely better. Day 16 is this little train carrying some Christmas trees. It's pretty cool. And really cool. Like the wheels on it and stuff. Definitely really good build for this. Like the uh, smokestack. Really like everything about it. Just as a whole. And if you really want, you could disconnect it from this bottom piece. I guess this makes it a lot less stable, but it makes it look a lot nicer, I think. See, now it looks more like a train. However, it's prone to, like, this will then bend around, and then this will fall off. Alright, so now there's a little castle build for day 17. Very cool. I like the, uh, these are those red cones. I think the whole thing looks nice. Definitely very cool. The back, obviously, not too much. But the rest of it looks very nice, I like the rocks and there's walkway going up and then the trees. Really cool uh, little build for day 17. The 18th build is this little doll built on a wedge plate, which is interesting. Anyways, legs and torso and then head. They're all okay, little builds. The final result is acceptable, but definitely not one of the better builds of this set. Day 19 is this small little gray and red van build, or truck, I'm not really sure. It's really small, if you can see my finger next to it, I guess. You can see, it's just a tiny little thing. Surprised it made it in here, means it was small, in that they didn't uh, actually include like a second car or something for this build, because, I mean, it's just kind of small for a 250 pieces set. Alright, for day 20, we have this nice little dragon or is it a caterpillar that's sitting up? Dang it, I actually can't tell. Is this a dragon? 
or a caterpillar who is standing up. Okay, I'm sorry, but I can't tell. Anyways, I think it looks nice. Whichever one. But the dragon, the color scheme works out kind of well. Looks pretty cool. The arms are a bit making me think it may be a caterpillar. In that case, it's kind of a little weird that the caterpillar is sitting up. But, I mean, caterpillars don't have arms anyways, but... I don't know, and then there's no wings. I don't really know. This one's hard for me. I'm sorry if you really know what this is. <laughs> tell me in the comments. Comment what day 20 is, because... I don't know. Whatever. It's cool. Whatever it is. <laughs> day 21 is this nice little sleigh for Santa Claus, or maybe just anyone who's looking to go sledding. But it's got some presents on it, which is making me think Santa Claus. Anyways. Little build on the bottom. Nice. Really uh, like this one. This is one of the better builds of this set. And yeah, it's pretty cool. The 23rd build, or builds, are these two little birds. These are both, these things together are both day 23. So the first one you build is this nice little guy. Brown on the front, and red and white. And this guy has orange, yellow, and uh, black. Or maybe that's a uh, little bit of lighter orange. Anyways. That's it for day 22. On to day 23. Alright, day 23 is this little snowman, which is okay. And you can see him. He's got like the old piece right there. I think the hat is maybe the worst part. You can see that green piece in there. All too obviously. And uh, it doesn't really come out looking like a top hat. But everything else about him is fine. And over on this little build for day 23. And finally, here's day 24. It's Santa and all his presents. So let's just get the presents out of the way quickly. You can see this green one with a nice gem for a bow. And there's this one with a little clear through bow or something on top. There's this nice one, green present with a bow, Christmas colors. A green and red present with a white bow. And this little brown present with I guess is supposed to be a green bow. And Santa Claus is a nice build. You can see him all around. And uh, yeah, really cool. It's exciting. It's Christmas, it's not Christmas when I'm recording this, of course, or anywhere near it, but when some people do build this, it will in fact be Chris almost Christmas, and it's kind of a neat little thing. And I think the presents are a nice touch to have all those. Alright, there we go, that's my review on the 2016 Christmas holiday build-up advent calendar thing. It's not really an advent calendar because they give you all the parts at the beginning, but anyways, that really is all I can say about it, but what's more important is what uh, you say about it, so put your thoughts of this set in the comment section down below, and remember to remember to think, and if you made it to the end of this video, I know it's probably ridiculously long at this point, but thank you so, so much, and Merry Christmas to you, you're amazing for uh, watching this entire video, thank you guys so much, and have a good holiday season, bye.